first day that the equipment is coming in and they're starting off with the flooring. Even though it's not as exciting as the actual workout equipment coming in, at first I was like, oh, it's just flooring. But then when I actually saw them place it on the floor, that was like the first transitional period of a warehouse turning into a gym. And it was pretty monumental actually. I was just like, like just the first black piece touching the floor, I could just imagine. It just kind of changed the whole feeling of the place. I was telling Casey this morning that it's super ironic. The reason why we didn't go to the gym this morning is because we're building a gym. So it's already been a year of planning, but now that it's the physical manifestation of the gym is happening, man, like we, we've been working eight days a week. We've been working 26 hours a day. It's just crazy, like we're mad tired. We painted last night, went home, woke up, showered, came back, boom, immediately this. So it's just nonstop, it's this. And you guys know, both of us do Just Kidding Films, so we're just balancing those two. And I'm super excited. Inside, I'm jumping for joy, but outside, I'm like, please, I need a nap. And this is like a dream come true for both of us, and for a lot of you guys. I posted a picture on Instagram, um, I, I believe last night, and a lot of you guys were like, oh my god, I can't wait to work out in there. And that's like definite fuel, because it's like, we are all in the same boat. Like we're trying to get this thing done as quickly as possible so that we can all just like vibe out together and, and become one. Not like that though, but you know what I mean. Today, one of the most important pieces of the gym came in and it's our monkey bar pull-up setup. So um, when I first started putting this together, it was more of a mental visualization thing. Cause I'd go on the website and I knew kind of what I wanted for the gym. And it was a lot of like visualizing, okay, if the 12 foot bar goes here and the eight foot bar you connect it, we wanted to have like 24 feet. But when the actual parts came in and then they started asking me all these questions of, oh, where do you want the single bar and the double bar and the monkey bar? And then I was just like, oh shit, this is way crazier than when I was visualizing it. But I was like, you know what, this is cool. Like, it's good to learn all these things. And I just kind of put myself through a crash course and we just started like figuring these things out. And I kind of had to make them disassemble like three times, which I feel really bad because they'll do it. And I'm like, wait, that doesn't look right. And he goes, I was telling you, sir, that what you wanted didn't make sense. And I'm like, I'm sorry, I didn't understand what the hell you're saying. But now we got a perfect piece of machinery and it's good. We have six squat stations, six bench press stations, six deadlift stations, six overhead press, tons of pull-up and muscle-up space, just an entire playground jungle gym of fitness. And my brains didn't explode. I, I really just want to work out already. 